Hello there. My name's Tim and I teach the viola at Eltham High School. And hopefully um, I'll be able to persuade you that this is a wonderful instrument today. So I uh, also teach the violin at Eltham High School and I'm the ensemble director of the chamber strings, which is our most advanced string ensemble. We have three ensembles and if you're just starting out, you'll uh, enter with our training strings and then we have uh, two ensembles beyond there. So the viola is part of the string family and so the or what we call the orchestral strings. So of course the guitar is also part of the string family but generally doesn't feature in ensembles so much. Uh, the instrument is produced mainly by drawing the bow across the string. <laughs> You can also pluck the instrument to produce a sound. You can pluck it like a guitar or pluck it like this. And mostly it's uh, used with the bow. The instrument has a really important role to play in our ensembles. It's that middle voice. It has a range that's very similar to the range of the human voice. Uh, so when you listen to the instrument, it often has, when it features in a melody, for example, it often has that uh, very sort of human quality to it because that, that register is very similar to our own voice. So here, for example, is a little bit of a film score, maybe you know this music. that music as the music from the Pirates of the Caribbean. We have lots of different techniques available other than just plucking and bowing. You can do lots of different things with the bow. For example, we can produce multiple sounds. So if you're considering a woodwind instrument or a brass instrument, it's very tricky on these instruments to produce more than one note at the same time, but it's very readily available on a stringed instrument So because we can bow in between the strings to bow to make contact with two strings at the same time, for example. And in our ensembles, uh, we explore a very wide range of genres. So we might play some things that are based around folk music, we might play some pieces that are based around film scores, music that was written a very long time ago. The first little tune I played for you is written in the 1600s. But the viola is also at home in jazz for example. Here's a little tune, uh, what we call a swing style. <laughs> So we can play in a very wide range of styles and that's in fact something that we, we take pride on, on exploring in all of our ensembles and um, especially in a, in a big group those are very uh, enjoyable things to, thing to do. You'll also get to play in small groups, you'll get to go on music camps with your fellow string players, uh, we put on lots of performances inside the school environment and also we go to festivals and perform there. And so all of those are things that you can look forward to uh, joining the string instrument family and hopefully you will particularly consider the viola. It's a really wonderful instrument. I can only give you a tiny snippet of it today. 
hopefully you'll consider it as your instrument of choice in our program. Good luck choosing.